start double inside ties, and we were opposite lead leg, okay? I'm a normally a right leg lead, I'm a left leg lead right now. And what that does is that kind of, it kind of creates that load, and then I'm releasing it for a second, and then in between I'm snapping. But the good part about that is, is when I do, when I, when I, whether I step back, whether I kind of circle and pivot, or whether I just do a little bit of a foot change here, right, from this position to this position, when I snap, my feet are set to attack or chase an angle, all right, which a lot of you guys are getting pretty creative. Um, Brandon's even got a little bit of a, he's, he's, st he's stepping back, he's snapping, he's actually shucking off his elbow and chasing backside off of, off of his partner's pressure, but you got to have a good bit of pressure to do that, okay? So this is what I want you to do. I want you to incorporate your head steers, okay, your pump fakes, all that stuff we've been doing, I'm steering the head, but I can use that head steer to change my lead leg. Okay, so make sure we're using some of these tactics, or maybe I'm starting lead leg like I talked about, and I, maybe I'm thumb blocking the backside, and I'm driving in to change my lead leg. When they start driving back into me, there's my snap. And I can start hustling to the angles, hustling to the legs, based off what that guy gets me. But again, remember, when I beat this guy in freestyle and chase him down into quad pod, I still got work to do. Okay, folk style a little bit easier, but I want you to kind of pick up the pace with your hands, and get a little bit more creative in here. But the beauty of this is, is now that we've felt this kind of snap and this little bit of a loop at the end, now you can even do it up in this position. I can head steer, and as he starts to circle, I can start redirecting his head without even snapping down. Okay, does everybody see what I'm talking about? Just a little redirect. So I'm steering the head, then he starts fighting his head back this way, and then I guide it back. So I'm head steering, he's fighting it back, I can start redirecting it. Then as I redirect it, I can start snapping down. So I got this little bit of a head steer, start snapping down, running down my doubles. Okay? But my feet are set to chase that guy down, to run that guy down. Okay? Or you can be more patient with it. Okay? You can be straight out in front, step back and snap, wait for him to come up, and then start attacking. You can be patient in those situations. But I want you to find about two or three good attacks based off this guy's reaction and ask him to give you different reactions. Hey, hit your, hand, hit your hands and run away a little bit. Hey, drive into me a little bit. All of those things that I'm gonna get different reactions from in a match. But again, the key is here. I'm loading, I'm either switching and snapping, stepping back and snapping, or I'm looping and snapping a little bit. But at the end, I'm trying to get that little bit of an angle with my hands. Questions? Good? Let's play with it, go.